Hello, it is Cody Mine here. Okay, anyways, um, today I will be showing you how to install Minecraft mods one point uh, yeah for version one point eight on Max. Okay, this will probably work for Windows, but um, it's for you guys, Mac users. This is the main for Mac. It's main for Max. Okay, so um, first what you're gonna want to do is open up Safari. And you're gonna want to go to this web, this website. The link will be in the description below. All the links will be in the description below for this video. Okay. So once you get to this page, Minecraft Forge downloads. It should say Minecraft Forge up there. There should be all this stuff. And we're gonna want 1.8 for today because reasons. I'm not gonna tell. Okay, so you wanna go here you want you're going to want to go and click installer. Man, I stutter a lot of these days. Huh, it's odd. Anyways, yeah, you're gonna wanna have to wait. Don't click any of this stuff. It's all ads. Do not click it, just click skip ad and wait for that to load. So once that is loaded, you're gonna wanna open up Minecraft Launcher. Okay, there you go. Sorry, the, it, this should not say right now. That should not say on your screen. Should not say that. Anyways, you're gonna want to go and edit profile, and then go on release. Oh god, no, 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 no. One point eight. If you're gonna do one point eight, you're gonna press play. You're gonna wait for it. And if there's this thing, it should pop up. Um. If it says something like install server or something, you gotta press install client. Install client, alright? Just install client. Client, 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 blah, 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 blah. Okay, anyways, press OK. We're gonna have to wait a while. And um, yeah, there you go. That was fast, actually. <laughs> no, like, because the other times I did it, it was like really slow. Now, when we open up Minecraft Launcher, we want to go to edit profile again, and we're going to scroll down. And this, these two should not be here for you guys. I just have different versions of Forge. So there should be a 1.8 version of Forge at the very bottom. You're going to click that and save profile and play. And then, yeah, wait for it to load. Okay, so once your Minecraft loads, it should say three mods loaded, three mods active, when you, and there should be this mods folder right there, besides Minecraft Realms. Beside, uh, okay. Anyways, there should be these mods: Minecraft Forge, Minecraft Mod, a Forge Mod Loader, Minecraft Loader Pack. So, we're gonna want to quit game again. And then, this is the fun part. Well, kinda. Wait, no. This is the second fun part. Now you're gonna want to search for any 1.8 Minecraft mod you want. So I'm um, for just for today. I'm going to be downloading the Koi mod. So usually the download button is usually at the very bottom of the page. Do not press these downloads. Don't yeah like don't don't press those like suspicious very suspicious download buttons. Only the text ones. All right. Okay, so you're gonna want to press this 1.8, just for 1.8, not for 1.7, or else it'll crash. Like seriously, it will actually crash. And something might, like that might pop open. And if it says here, you're gonna want to click here. Wait, did it download? Yep, there it is. So you're gonna want to open up Minecraft. In other tutorials, people may go to Finder and search up at like do like and and then. You go to like library or something. Today I'm not doing that because I know some people don't have their Minecraft folder in there. So you're gonna want to go to edit profile for this and go to open game direct. D I R. So there should be this mods folder. If there isn't, watch the video from the beginning once again and make sure you did everything correct and a okay. So yeah, okay, okay. okay. So, you're going to want to drag the mod, well, it should be a jar folder. If it's not, it's kind of suspicious, it may not work. So you're going to want to drag it into your mods folder. 
and this is what it looks like for other windows so it may be like this inside the mods folder right there right here yeah got it yeah it's all that okay that didn't make sense oh anyways the mods folder if it is not there actually you will have to make a new folder uh... oh god no 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 it doesn't say huh it's odd okay i think you can figure out how to make a new folder yourself and call it mods all lowercase and yeah drag it in okay now you're gonna want to save profile once again and play and wait for minecraft to load yeah okay once minecraft has loaded it should say four mods loaded four mods active if you download two it should be five if you download three it should be six if you download four yeah and so on so yeah we have the koi mod there koi version 1.11.3 mod state available that's good you should have your mod inside the mod list now you're gonna want to go to single player and create new world sorry those are other worlds and test if your mod worked. So you're gonna, yeah, just name your world, world anything. Uh, I'd say it cheats on because, you know, you're gonna wanna wait for your mod to load. <clears throat> okay, so I'm, I've loaded the world. And bacon! <laughs> That's all off the topic. Sorry, guys. Oh, did I add a new tree? Wait, no, never mind. <laughs> okay, sorry. So, yeah. And there's, I think that's the koi spawn egg. There you go. That's spawn koi. And, yeah. Oh, I thought it was just flying. Well, I just ran randomly picked this mod for not really any reason. So, yeah. So yeah, now you can enjoy your mod. Congratulations. You have installed the mod using Forge onto 1.8. And subscribe and like for <laughs> Ultimate Voice Crack by